Hello everyone. My name is Markus Sandholm. I'm the product manager for Alpha Laval's range of automatic filters. Uh, welcome to Alpha Laval Speakers Corner. Today we have uh, chosen to present our view on how to secure an efficient Lubo circuit in the main engine on board ultra large vessels. The solution I'm going to present to you is based on Alpha Laval's new family of large lubrica lubricating oil filters called Protector X350. And this product family has been launched on the market during the last uh, couple of two years. And uh, now the range is fully completed to cover the flows of even the largest crosshead engines produced in the world today. I will uh, show a short animation to quickly illustrate the working principles of the, of the filter. The filter is based on the classic Alpha Laval filter design with disk type filter elements assembled together in a filtering unit. Uh, the new design is, is optimized and it has uh, a reduced number of components compared to previous solutions. The dirty oil from the sump enters through the inlet port in the bottom of the filter. It passes through a strainer and then the oil is traveling through the sleeve located in the middle of the filtering unit, uh, where it passes through the filter elements out on the clean side and to the engine. The particles in the lube oil is trapped on the mesh on the filter elements. At any given time, one sector in the filtering unit is isolated from the inlet flow and uh, is put in bypass mode, which means that the clean oil from the clean side is led backwards on the elements and taking all the trapped partic particles with it. This backflush flow is led through a dedicated channel in the middle of the filtering unit up to the diversion chamber. The rotation of the distributor is by means of a hydraulic motor that gets its uh, power from the pressure in the system. Therefore, no external power is required. The benefit of the continuous backflushing is uh, it keeps the pressure drop over the filter completely constant over time. It also it never allows the dirt to get trapped on the mesh, which uh, means uh, very long inspection intervals and extremely long lifetime of the filter elements. So all in all, this new optimized design, it still uh, includes the, the classical benefits with the Alpha Laval filter. It means it is very compact in relation to its capacity. It is very robust and reliable, and it has the the disk type elements with the triple mesh inside, which is very strong and, and, and reliable. And thanks to, to the hydraulic motor, no external power is required to operate the filter. So back to the challenge we wanted to present today. Uh, there are some uh, trends in the industry. Uh, we see a request for even bigger vessels. Normally this means uh, bigger main engines and higher lube oil flows in the main lube oil circuit. In general, there is a big request to optimize the design and the solutions on board and to reduce the total cost, which uh, includes not only the direct product cost, but the cost 
for installation and of course for operating and maintaining the equipment. In, uh, in the biggest engines today, the main Lubo circuit, we often see it split into three lines. Uh, this means uh, you typically have only 50% redundancy and uh, you have a, a more complex installation. This uh, works fine also for the Alpha Laval filters, but uh, we would like to, pro to propose an even more efficient and uh, reliable solution. So still to illustrate a typical design today in the biggest engines. So you split the line into three where the full flow is uh, split 50-50 uh, on two lines. And then you have one bypass line that is able to, to handle 50% of the full flow. Uh, in some situations we know that uh, dividing a flow into two can uh, be challenging in terms of keeping uh, an even flow in the two lines. So what we would like to suggest also for the biggest engines is to install one filter to cover the full flow as well as to install a bypass line with 100% redundancy. This means a simplified installation and it means uh, a reduction of components. And to illustrate how it could look like, I have uh, two different alternatives which can depend on the space available on board and sometimes on the preferences by the shipyard. Uh, some uh, shipyards prefer to, to make the, the piping and the bypass line on the yard and then it could look like this with the full flow through one filter and a bypass line able to handle 100% of the flow. The other solution I would like to suggest is to put everything into one unit with one line and uh, complete with a change of a valve and uh, the flow can be led through the bypass filters in, in, in a maintenance or, or cleaning situation. So with this uh, new protector X350 family, we can make a classic one or two line installation even for the biggest engines produced today with flows up to 1,200 cubic meters per hour. We can offer 100% redundancy, uh, a clean, uh, efficient installation, tested and reliable solution to an attractive total cost. Thanks for your attention and uh, welcome to ask questions and to discuss this topic.